Waiting on the cold front to come through. It's off to our west still. Temperatures are dropping now into western Ohio. You will notice a big difference by the time you wake up tomorrow morning, and it won't be as warm through the afternoon. Now, this storm system has been a lot different than the last couple, the last two in particular the last two Saturdays, lots of gusty wind. Tonight, the gusty wind is off into the northwestern Great Lakes region. We are still a little breezy, and that will continue early tonight, but winds start dropping into tomorrow, and we won't have any uh, strong winds to worry about after we go past uh, really the next couple of hours. So for our temperatures while we are sitting in the 60s, enjoy this while we have it. It'll take us a few days to get back here, but we will warm things back up as we head into the weekend. Right now, though, we're waiting on these 40s that you see into western uh, or portions of Indiana approaching western Ohio to move in. I expect that to come with the cold front, something that will start pushing into our area as we get closer to 2 or 3 in the morning. So we stop on Future tra Tracker at 3 a.m. Notice the temperatures behind this little line showing dropping fast. As that pushes off to the east, well, we'll see our temperatures then starting to slide into the 40s. Still watching for some showers and sprinkles around through at least the morning. I do expect to see some scattered pockets of it, like rain or sprinkles and lots of clouds to start our day. Now, it will be cooler into the afternoon. This particular model, perhaps a little aggressive on the rain into the afternoon, but there's still a chance for a few raindrops for the early part of the afternoon as we head deeper into it. Well, rain starts to taper off and the clouds will start to break as we head into the evening. Once they clear, it's pretty much smooth sailing from there. It will be colder on your Friday morning. Lows are in the 30s, but we have a lot of sunshine to look forward to. We get back to the upper 40s by noon. Afternoon highs about low to mid 50s Friday. As we go into the weekend, I'm watching Saturday for plenty of sunshine around the area. Dry weather. We could see a few clouds around Saturday night. Sunday for Easter, looking at a lot of sunshine. Temperatures continuing to warm. The seven-day forecast after tomorrow looking pretty fantastic, especially with what we've dealt with the last uh, couple of weeks. So 46 for tonight. Still some scattered showers and sprinkles of rumble of thunder not completely out of the question. Now we will watch for the start of the day. Uh, still watching for raindrops scattered about the area. Temperatures quickly dropping into the 40s and then the rest of the day it'll be a struggle to try and get our temperatures back to about 52 degrees. I'm not sure why the lightning is showing up on this graphic. Not looking for any storms tomorrow but a couple of showers and sprinkles through at least early afternoon. You're seven day forecast. Well, lots to smile about in here. Those temperatures each day gradually getting warmer. Lots of sun in there, mostly sunny Friday and Saturday. Plenty of sun around on Easter Sunday. Next week will still be partly sunny in there and we're in the upper 60s and then mid 70s on Wednesday.